I'm Matt from Chaparral Motorsports here with the Oakley Airbrake MX Goggle. There's many goggle manufacturers out there that make a good product, but I think it's undeniable that the Airbrakes are the most innovative goggle on the market. They've hit the nail on the head in so many different ways, and I think it's safe to say that they are the best goggle. But then again, that's just my take on them. I'm sure there's plenty out there that disagree. So let's go ahead and start pulling these apart, literally. Other than its incredible strength, which we'll jump into, you should know that every part on this goggle is replaceable. So even though they are pretty penny, they're well worth the money because you can beat the heck out of them and replace whatever it is that needs to be replaced, and essentially you have a brand new goggle. The lens is a huge contributor to its success. It's made from injection molded plutonite. They put it through the same test standards as military and law enforcement eyewear, and it also meets the ANSI impact requirements. So it's molded to the exact curvature of the frame, and it's much thicker than the standard Lexan lens. What that also means is that it's optically correct. When you take a flat lens and bend it into shape, it distorts your vision. Also, with having such a wide angle view, you can see more of your surroundings and see them more clearly. It's going to take some work to pop this thing out of the frame or even puncture it for that matter. A big reason for that, other than the material, is the design. This is the switch lock mechanism. It basically locks the lens in the frame and it doesn't allow it to come out at any one point. Plus those notches get annoying after a while. They just never stick in right. All you do is pull down on these levers and the lens pops right out. Just like that. So another big change was at the bridge. It's now wider and it comes up a lot higher. And this does a couple of things. It relieves any air restriction or pinching at the nose. It allows you to see further down in the front as well. So I had mentioned that everything is replaceable. So let me show you how that works. We'll start with the lens. Once again, pull the levers down on both sides and then pop the lens out. And then also notice that it has the tear off posts on it. Then the outriggers come off. You'll also see that third tear off post on there as well. You just push on the bottom tab, flip it up and away from the frame. If you wanted to swap out the strap for a different color or if it happens to tear, you can replace that as well. This would also be the same way to install a roll-off system. Next would be the face film and the inner frame. And you know a cool thing about this is that there's actually a function to the black texture in here. It'll reduce the glare. It's very similar to eye black on a baseball player in the outfield. So all you do is pop each one of these tabs off and boom, it's off. Lastly, what you get in the box is this really nice goggle case, and this is going to protect them when you throw it in with your other gear. You also get a pack of tear-offs, and you also get this film cover to put over the lens. It's similar to a smartphone screen protector. So that's pretty much it for the air brakes. They start at $160, and they come in a bunch of different colors. Of course, the price will vary with each color combo. Also, some come with the iridium lens. You can find all of the colors and more info, including the replacement parts, at shapmoto.com. Don't forget to subscribe to us on YouTube. Thanks for watching. I'm Matt. We'll see you again.